This is the densest and most expensive filament that I've ever 3D printed with. It's 75% tungsten by weight, and as a result, this 100 gram sample is only about 10 meters long. This stuff is super rigid, and when in a coil, it feels more like wire than plastic filament. Prusa Research originally developed this unique polymer for use in printing on-the-fly radiation shielding in hospitals because while tungsten may be excellent at attenuating alpha, beta, and gamma radiation, it's extremely costly and time-consuming to have components custom machined out of it. Tungsten is relatively chemically inert and hypoallergenic, so it's perfect for use in a medical environment, and unlike other filament additives like carbon fiber, you don't have to worry about irritating fibers getting all over your workspace, although you're still going to need an abrasive-resistant nozzle. I'll be putting this Revo Obsidian nozzle through its paces and printing this super-dense decorative spiral that doubles as a jig for testing the gamma shielding efficacy of various thicknesses of the tungsten PETG. This part works surprisingly well for demonstrating how different energy gammas get attenuated differently in tungsten, and an irregular shape like this would be very difficult to machine out of pure tungsten. This filament prints great despite being mostly metal and produces parts with this attractive matte finish, but if the printed look isn't your cup of tea, this filament also polishes up beautifully and ends up looking and feeling like actual metal.